getting into college requires a lot of different steps. And you have to be really organized because you don't want to miss deadlines. Um, so what I would do is starting freshman year is I would have a checklist of all the things that I need to do during that year to make sure that I'm ready for college. And if there's a website, it's the College Board. So if you go on www.collegeboard.com, they have a checklist for ninth grade, for 10th grade, 11th grade, and 12th grade. And I would encourage you to take a look at those. But what's gonna happen is in your ninth and 10th grade year, you're gonna wanna take as many challenging classes in high school as you can. When you're a, a junior is when you're gonna to wanna to take your college entrance exams. And you may have heard of the SAT or the ACT. Those are the two most common tests and you need to take those your junior year, which means you have to start studying for them summer before your junior year. Once you take those tests, then you should start thinking about the colleges that you want to attend. So you, you wanna think about what do you wanna be when you grow up? You want to start doing some research, looking at line at different colleges, and you should have a list of about 10 colleges that you're interested in by the end of your junior year. You should meet with your counselor at, their, at your school because they can help you put that list together. And then during the summer before your senior year, you'll want to start writing your essays because your applications for college require you to write essays sometimes. And those can take some, some work and some time. And you want to have people read them over before you submit them. So start working on those the summer before your senior year. And then once the fall of senior year comes around, you should have everything in place to start applying to college. A lot of colleges will let you apply through something called a common app. And you can go online and, and check out the Common App. You can start filling that out. I believe it opens in October. And um, But colleges will also ask for additional information. So make sure you're not just looking at the Common App, but also at the website for the colleges that you're interested in. And then finally, and a lot of times most importantly, make sure that you're applying for financial aid. So in October of your senior year, there is something called the FAFSA, which is the Federal Application for Student Aid, and this is where the federal government can give you money for college. Make sure that you and your family apply for the FAFSA. October 1st is the opening date, and this will allow you to access financial aid, um, as well as applying for scholarships and financial aid from the schools that you're applying to. So there's a lot of things that you, that you need to do. Don't get overwhelmed, just have your plan have your deadlines, have your checklist, and work through it um, together with some grown-ups in your life who you trust, either teachers, college advisors, or your parents, or maybe um, siblings or other folks that you know who may have been through the process, and you'll get through it.